and Jeff died. I thought I'd be alone. No, you and Annie are the best things that ever happened to me. Mom, it's David. He was in his client's plane, and the plane went down. He's dead, Annie. I don't know how we're going to get through this again. Hello. This is Barbara Waldron from the bank. It's about your mortgage. You're two months behind on your payment. Barbara, I don't, I don't have a mortgage. I paid it off five years ago. Yes, but you took out a new mortgage early last year. Did you get the 401k that I sent over? Karen, the account is empty. It was brought to my attention that you took out a very large life insurance policy. Is that true? No, he took that out. I didn't know anything about that. I think David was his perfect husband, but what if he wasn't? I had Joe check in with his friend at Vital Records about David's birth certificate. They couldn't find it. They did find a David Miller with your husband's birth date and social security number. He died five years ago. David, he wasn't who he said he was. He thinks that David might have had another wife. Excuse me. What are you doing here? I think you might have known my husband. David Miller? Yeah, I thought I did. <laughs> Are you saying David's still alive? David? Sit! <laughs> David! Oh, Annie, thank God you're okay. Karen, it's me. David, where's Annie? Tell me where she is or I'm calling the police right now. Then you'll never see her again. What do you want? You have a very large sum of money coming in today. I will take it. No, I'm not doing it until you give me back Annie. I have your baby. I took your money. You don't know who you're messing with! What do you want? I want the money! I need to see my daughter right now! Annie? Kara! Did you just like all the rest? I don't know. Where is she? I don't know. 